my name is uh, Kolani Sibunda. I'm a full-time uh, visual artist. I reside uh, in Fulani location. I'm also a co-founder of Open Heart Studios, co-founder of Open Heart uh, Gallery at Khumsana. Uh, yeah. It started uh, back in the Eastern Cape. Uh, I was still young in Umtata. So I remember uh, my, my mom used to make fire outside. So I would go to the fireplace and take few charcoals and uh, start to draw on the walls. Yeah, I remember I used to fight a lot with my mom uh, about that. But it's when man, I, uh, I think it all started because uh, it's when I realized that, oh, wow, I can draw. Uh, I can use charcoal. And uh, yeah, so ever since then, uh, I don't remember me stopping. I've been like pushing, going forward and uh, trying to learn like new new things, uh, new techniques, and also introducing myself uh, into new uh, mediums. I don't use charcoal anymore. Uh, it's all about now, uh, it's all about how do I want to, to express myself. Uh, which medium can I use to, to, to express myself freely? So I think acrylics, uh, they do work uh, for me. I love colors. Um, it's easy to tell my stories uh, using different colors. If I want to, to, to tell a story of a happy family, it's easy to me like to use like bright colors, more vibrant colors. If I want to tell a sad story or to set that sad mood, it's easy for me to mix those dark browns, dark, uh, dark greens, and desaturate the color to set that sad mood on the painting. Yeah, so also it goes also with uh, how do I want to evoke certain like uh, emotions to the viewer because I believe that the painting must create a dialogue. There must be a dialogue between a viewer and the painting. So it's easy for me like, uh, to do that using like colors. Like being a, 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 a visual artist in South Africa, I don't want to lie. Well, we don't, we don't have a lie. It is not easy. You need like proper, proper support from your family, friends. But if you don't get like any support, I'm telling you, you at some point you, you will feel like you want to quit. But if you are a true visual artist, there will be that voice within you that says why you started. You see, with me, that's why I'm still, even today, a visual artist, because there's that voice that says, Polani, why you started. So if you are passionate about something, there will be that voice, even if you want to quit, there will be that voice that will come back and the, the candles, like everything, if you want to quit, and you would go back and, and do your craft, if it's a, like a true calling. It's collaborations, you see. I like to collaborate. I like to share my ideas with young and old uh, visual artists, but... Uh, I don't like competition because Olani Sivunda, or I can say Olani is a competition of Sivunda. That's all. So I don't have competition, I don't want to lie. Even if I can 
collaborate with anyone i know that i will be not like competing but it's like we are sharing like ideas or so trying to come up with a new thing in art industry so to me learn man i love to collaborate uh i think uh visual artists in south africa they must start to collaborate we must start also to share like space because some of these artists they don't have like uh, art studios and some of us we do have these art studios we do have like resources and now because of competition we don't want to open heart for other visual young visual artists we don't want to open doors for other visual artists so for me no i don't have competition my competition is me and uh, i'm pushing every day i want to be better so that if i do collaborate next year with other like great visual artists they can see that okay polani sibunda is one of the hard working visual artists in south africa Amazing. Thank you.